what's up YouTube? How you guys doing today? Hope everybody's having a wonderful day out there. I got me another box today. That is one I'm extremely excited for because it is my Marvel Collector Core X-Men box. So, and Wolverine's right on the front of it. So, I'm really excited about this one. Um, I'm a huge X-Men fan. Uh, growing up, that was one of the things, man. X-Men on X-Men cartoon and everything. So I'm really big into X-Men. I really like them. So I'm really interested in seeing what they put in this box. Um, I know they do spoilers sometimes. Luckily, I have not seen any spoilers, so I don't know anything that's in this box, which is really cool. Um, this runs about $32, and that's including shipping and everything. It is a bi-monthly box. Um, I will leave the link down below if you guys are interested in getting your own collector core. Um, I have enjoyed uh, the Marvel one especially, and uh, I also enjoyed their Star Wars box quite a bit as well. So, without further ado, let's see what's in the X-Men Marvel Collector Core box for December. Da -da -da. All right. First off, we are going to get our patch and pin. And, yeah. Now, my patch at this time is falling off. <laughs> so, patch and pin. Let's get them off of there and let's check out, see who's on there this month. We have. Oh, um. It looks like Storm almost. I may be wrong. Don't quote me on that. But very cool. And the patch this month is Magneto, it looks like. Mag, let's see, let's take it out of the bag. Bag gives it an awful glare sometimes. Here, let's see here. Get it out, get it out, get it out. Come on. There we go, that's better. Alright. Magneto. Very cool. Alright, so that's our patch and pen. Looks like Storm and Magneto. An odd combination, but nonetheless, there it is. Alright, so. Spoiler card, it's going to stay down there for a while. Feels like the comics right up on front. And we have the Champions number one variant edition. Uh, pop, pop, pop variant. So, very cool. I really wanted to get this comic too, and so this is pretty cool to get the variant number one. And now I just got to go and get the rest of them because I, I think they're up to like number three on this one. So, very cool. So, newer comic. That's always good. Alright, so, got the shirt. Now I got the shirt. Alright, let's see what the shirt is. It looks like a really cool shirt. Because I like the gray and black. And that's exactly what it is, is gray and black. Let's see. It is. Let's see here. It is Xavier's. Xavier's 1963 Westchester, New York. So it looks like it's like a like a school shirt almost. Like yeah, you're representing a school. So that's pretty cool. I I dig it. Pretty plain to the point. I like it. Xavier's School for Gifted Youngsters in the middle is what it says. So very cool. Okay, so we're down here to the bottom, and you know, sometimes we get two pops, sometimes we get a pop and something else, so we're going to have to see what we get this 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 time around. Um, I don't think we got two pops, so let me go ahead and take the red pop out first and see what the pop is, and then we'll check out what the other item is. Well, it's not the pop at all. I don't know if we got a pop, but this is really cool. I like this a lot. This is the Rock Candy. And it is Mystique. Now, if you've <coughs> watched previous uh, videos of mine, you know I really, really like these figures a lot. Um, and to see that they're actually doing Marvel, because they were only doing uh, DC for a long time. So it's nice to see them doing Marvel and to get a, an exclusive one. Uh, don't follow me. Is awesome. And of it being Mystique is even more awesome. Because she is one of my favorite X-Men. Well, I'll call her an X-Men. She kind of anti-hero type thing. But 
Very cool look at her. She is a bobblehead, um, but she doesn't bobble too bad. Not not really bad at all. So um, very cool, very well done. I love I love the face. Check that out. That's awesome. And just her pose in general is really really cool. I like that. I like that a lot. She's actually got skulls around her for like a bell. How cool is that? That that was really well done by Funko. I like that a lot. Well done, well done. All right. All right, now what I felt in here else was, it didn't feel like a pop, it felt bigger, but we'll see here. Let's see, yeah, oh wow, oh wow. Okay, this is freaking awesome. We've got Wolverine motorcycle how awesome is that that is freaking cool check out the back of that bad boy wow okay this just blew me away um, wow wow um, I gotta take him out because I gotta see him and you guys deserve to see him as well. So I'm going to attempt to take him out from the bottom here. And guys, I'm not going to lie to you. I believe, or I know for a fact, that I do believe this is my first pop ride. And how cool is he? How freaking awesome is that? Wow! Got his claws coming out and everything. That is freaking sweet. That is awesome. That, my friends, is extremely awesome. To get a, it's 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 a pop ride. First off, to get a pop ride in the Funko box, period, is freaking sweet. Second off, getting Wolverine on his motorcycle is freaking awesome. He's probably my second favorite Marvel character uh, up to Ghost Rider. So this is awesome. I like. I dig this. I, I really, really like this a lot. I, I mean, the rock candy is awesome. This is awesome. They did a really, really good job with this box this month. Um, I am very highly impressed. Very highly impressed with Funko's box this month. You guys didn't let us down. This X-Men box is awesome. Uh, it's very high up there. This is awesome. All right, so. Wow, okay. To recap. We got Wolverine on his motorcycle, which is just freaking awesome. We got the ever so awesome and lovely Mystique Rock Candy, which is just very, very well made. I really dig that a lot. We got the very cool number one variant edition of the Champions. And we got the really cool but simplified t-shirt of the Xavier. Kind of like a school t-shirt, which I really dig. I like that. I like that a lot. That is something I will definitely wear. And of course we got our, I believe that storm patch, and our Magneto. Then, so... It looks like next month um, is going to be Superhero Showdowns, which has features uh, Cap and, uh, um, oh wow, I just lost his name. That is su That sucks. Why did I just lose his name all of a sudden? I had it right on the tip of my tongue. Red Skull. Whatever, I am not, I've, I've just totally lost names here, guys, so I apologize. 
But there, here's the uh, rest of the info for the spoiler card. If you guys are interested and you want to pause it, feel free. Um, but let me know what you guys thought of this month's box, this uh, Funko's box to me. I'm, I'm impressed. Um, this just bounced it right back up there to almost uh, when they did the Hulkbuster uh, pop. So, to me, this was a really, really awesome box. I really loved it. But let me know what you guys think down in the comments below. If it's your first, first time, make sure you hit that subscribe button. If you want to hit me up on social media, you can. Facebook, Twitter, Instagram. Links down below. And I hope you guys have a wonderful night. And see you next time on another unboxing. Bye-bye.